with chickens. We have a ton of eggs all the time that are fresh and we love eating them. I'm always looking for new ways to cook them, different recipes. And today I am very excited to have gotten the Dash Egg Bite Maker. And in this box, it has the egg maker and it has right on here showing you some different things you can make besides the yummy little egg bites. Uh, you can also make cheesecake bites, flan, and they have a recipe book according to the box in here as well. So I am super excited to check this out and show you guys what the box looks like. When you open up the actual box, you have, of course, the egg maker and you have these four trays, which you use for the egg bites. They are kind of like a rubbery type of a uh, material. And you have this little booklet in there. It says, hello, foodie. And then inside of here, it talks about where you can go to review. And it also tells that you can join on Instagram at by dash. And then it also has this envelope in there. And when you open that envelope, it has the instruction manual and a recipe guide in here. And it gives you some information about the egg maker, how to use the egg maker. And also it has some recipes in here. Oh, I'm really excited about using this. I already have started over here with my eggs. This is four eggs. I've added a pinch of salt into them and I'm going to add in my cheese and I'm going to add in the cottage cheese. I am combining the eggs, shredded cheese, cottage cheese, salt, pepper in a bowl, and then I'm going to add one of the silicone cups that comes with the box into the actual griddle part. And then it tells me that I need to spray the inside of the silicone cups with nonstick cooking spray so that the egg bites will release clean and then I'm going to pour the mixture into the cups and cook this for 10 to 12 minutes and we'll see how it turns out. These have been cooking now for 12 minutes and this is what they look like. A hack for the Dash Egg Bites Maker is to use it without the cups and to just put the eggs straight into this, kind of like a griddle. In this, I have two eggs. I scrambled them. I put vegan cheese and hot sauce and a little bit of pepper. And I cook it for about five minutes. You just kind of want to watch it. And it's a pretty thick omelet. You can just pop this out or you can fold it over if you'd like, add more cheese to it. In my case, I'm going to put it on a wrap. But this makes for a really great little griddle, actually, instead of just using it for egg bites. 